This is Eyewitness News in High Definition with live breaking news. Many travelers go online to look for reviews and pictures of hotels they're interested in staying in, but what they find is not always honest. In some cases, hotels pay for positive reviews. And as consumer specialist Rick Romero found out, the beautiful pictures of hotel rooms, lobbies, and pools posted online may be fakes. A serene pool, a stunning waterfall surrounded by luxurious shops, and a bed made up perfectly. These are images hotels like to showcase. But this bed, made up with rumpled linens, is what a reviewer from the travel review website Oyster.com found when she stayed at a luxurious New York City hotel. Not this room photo that appeared on the hotel's website. On its website, Oyster posts what it calls photo fakeouts, side-by-side -side pictures showing the staged images the hotel wants you to see, and what the anonymous reviewers really found during their stay. Elim Seidman, the co-founder and CEO of Oyster, says hotels use a variety of tricks to make their properties look more appealing. At the extreme, it's actually cropping out buildings, cropping out, you know, uh, phone wires or, uh, you know, electric wires, um, making the pool seem bigger. So if you get down on your knees really close to the pool, you crop out the edge, it's going to look a lot bigger. So when you arrive, it's a bathtub in the brochure, it looks like this beautiful big pool. A Hawaii resort posted this picture of paradise, a couple walking along a tranquil beach. The Oyster reviewer snapped a shot of the beach from the same angle, but this time showing giant cranes and construction fencing for a new resort. This buffet from a Caribbean resort was more sparse and a lot less appealing when the Oyster reviewer showed up and a traffic light magically disappeared outside a hotel on Miami's South Beach. The London West Hollywood is a hip hotel off the Sunset Strip that caters to high-end travelers and celebrities. On its website, a picture of the hotel's balcony is dressed to the nines with plants and fresh fruit. Oyster found the balcony rather plain with nothing but a table and a lounge chair. The Sapatel Los Angeles is a triple-A four-star resort on Beverly Boulevard in L.A. A photo of the hotel pool on Sofitel's website is inviting. In fact, the same picture, taken from the same angle, shows up on Orbitz, Hotels.com, and Expedia's websites. An Eyewitness News producer using a digital camera found the same alluring pool. But right next door to the Sofitel, a giant Macy's store that's part of the imposing Beverly Center across the street. The pool shot that they've put on in their brochure and on their website makes it look like you're in this kind of tranquil environment. They've just cropped out the Macy's in the background. In fact, the Sofitel is also across the street from Cedars Sinai, one of the busiest hospitals in Southern California. When we interviewed Oyster CEO, we saw several ambulances and fire trucks whiz by with their sirens blasting. All right across the street from the Sofitel. Oysters reviewers often take hundreds of snapshots of the hotels they stay in, giving travelers a true sense of what they can expect. Oyster says hotels often Photoshop scenes like this one, in which a fake light is imposed on a Miami hotel's gazebo. Another popular marketing tool? Using models to pose in front of near-empty pools that are often packed with guests. Oyster.com, which is a free website, has hotel reviews of 14 cities and islands, far less than its competitors, although the site is rapidly adding more hotels and more destinations to its database. Now, you can find out more about Oyster by logging on to our website, abc7.com, and clicking on Save Money Consumer on the left side of the homepage. This is Rick Romero, ABC7 Eyewitness News.